आईपीसी सीआरपीसी और भारतीय साक्ष्य अधिनियम के संदर्भ में लाए गए तीन बिलों पर सपा नेता कपिल सिब्बल का बयान एक तरफ सरकार पुलिस को अधिक शक्ति दे रही है और दूसरी तरफ लोगों को चुप करा रही है दिस कंट्री इज दिस यूज ऑफ द पुलिस फोर्सेज फॉर पोलिटिकल एंड वेर एवर द बीजेपी इज इन पावर यू नो दैट पोलिटिकल अपोनेट विल बी अटैक एंड द पुलिस फोर्स बाय एंड लार्ज इज वर्किंग अंडर द डायरेक्शन ऑफ द पोलिटिकल पर्सन इन पावर of the people in power of the government in power in other words they are serving a political end that's the real problem why because the police is not is not no longer an independent force you see that in the happenings of the lo local state police you see that happening with the ed with the enforcement directorate and occasionally you see that happening with the cbi as well so if the whole police system is directed towards Uh, fulfilling a political agenda and functions under the directions of the government in power of people in power and in that context you give the policemen custody for or the enforcement agencies custody for 60 days and 90 days then it is a it is a recipe for disaster it means there will be more misuse of that political force so i think this is completely unacceptable in a democracy that's the first issue the second issue is the way they have changed the sedition law they say that look we have abrogated the sedition law deleted that section 123 of the, of the penal code but now they have put into place provisions relating to national security without really defining in what circumstances a person can be prosecuted for national security and most of these provisions are extremely vague and as you know that students academics uh um, uh teachers uh, uh, people, journalists political opponents are all being prosecuted for national security right and now with with the further wave and expanding the power of exactly it's much worse than sedition expanding the power of national security means that more people more political opponents will be and you people will be prosecuted or proceeded against it is to silence silence the people so on the one hand they are giving police more powers on the other hand they are wanting to silence people this is just completely unacceptable and the first thing i want to ask is which which expert committee dealt with this this is all introduced in in parliament in the rajya sabha through secrecy nobody knew which is that uh, expert committee what were the recommendations that expert committee nobody knows and suddenly this bill has been brought and in fact it's a very sort of uh, cut and paste sort of thing most of the things are what the old code had and, and it's cut and paste it's ill thought sentences are not complete the heading is inappropriate 